Hello YouTube, this is Game Tester PC for another video. Um, I've already done Cricket Coach 2011, now we moved on to Cricket Coach 2012. And let's compare the differences between the two games. So, we've got the same four options here. We're going to click New Game, and the database is only 2012 this time. Remember, this is the Alpha 1 beta version, as it says here, for testing purposes. So we're going to click Load here, and it will load the database. Choose our four modes. We're going to do new career mode, and this is where it looks different. It's more zoomed in. Um, we've still got the the same amount of international teams, the Bahrain and Suriname down the bottom again, and we've got all of our teams here. So let's create um, a campaign with Hampshire. So we're going to go PC tester. Oh, that's really annoying me. I've got some kind of issue. Right, and continue. So this is the difference now. As you can see, um, Hampshire Under-19s and Hampshire Second Eleven. In this game, you can take control of all three teams. So if I go Job Settings, you've got the Hampshire Second Eleven, which I can take full control of, and you've got the Hampshire Under-19s I can take full control of. Now, with, there's a problem with the Under-19s, which I'll show you. Well, that, this is fine. Adam Rouse is an actual Hampshire under 19s player because that's that's quite surprising because you would assume that they would make the names up but no these are players that are in the actual teams but I'll show you when it comes to under 19s the problem so if I click ask assistant to handle the um, contracts everything looks the same from here on just a different format overview news record of achievement is now all under the main tabs let's fast forward Let's hold space to stop now. So we go job settings. I'm going to go Hampshire and the 19s take full control. We're going to fast forward again. Now here we go. So this is our Hampshire second 11. So let's put forward in there. And there's our under 19s. And it looks like they've actually patched it because what happened before was you had our team, then you had uh, Katic, 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 and so on. So it was always Simon Katic on their team. But it looks like it's been patched, so I'm going to autoplay that match. That's your under 19s. It's pretty nifty. I think it's a lot better. And it looks like Hampshire have won anyway, so that's always good news. So we're going to fast forward. And then we'll have a look around once we stop. So here we are. Now, so our next game is against Derbyshire at the Rose Bowl. It should be the Aegeus Bowl, that needs to update. Remember, this is the beta version. Player search is the same, so let's search for young talent James Taylor who transferred from Leicestershire to Nottinghamshire there's the update of it there's his career stats, his season stats details that's all of his ability in the game still got our all time records highest winning margins in 2020 cricket and yes, yeah, so it's pretty good player ins and outs So it's pretty good. You've got our overseas player Simon Katic playing for us. It's all looking good. If you want any more in-depth or um, more centralised videos, please tell me in game suggestions, put in the comment section. Subscribe and rate. Thanks YouTube and I'll see you soon.